in a significant development in the ongoing trial of actor Jonathan Majors. The 911 call he made shortly before his arrest for alleged assault was played in court on Tuesday. Two New York Police Department NIPT officers, Officer Eric Lucero and Sergeant Brian Hansen, who were present during Majors' arrest, testified at the trial. The trial, which has attracted significant attention, centers around the alleged assault incident involving Majors. The actor, known for his roles in popular television shows and films, was arrested by the NIPT following an altercation in which he is accused of assaulting another individual. During the proceedings, the court played the 911 call made by Majors just moments before his arrest. The call provided insight into the events leading up to the alleged assault. Although the specific details of the call have not been disclosed, the testimony from Officer Lucero and Sergeant Hansen shed light on the circumstances surrounding Major's arrest. Officer Lucero and Sergeant Hansen, who were on duty at the time of the incident, recounted their observations and actions during the arrest. Their testimonies played an essential role in establishing the timeline of events and providing an understanding of the context in which the alleged assault occurred. The defense and prosecution teams are presenting their respective cases, with additional witnesses and evidence expected to be introduced in the coming days. The trial will continue to unfold as both sides present their arguments and the jury evaluates the evidence presented. Majors, who maintains his innocence, has been actively participating in his trial and has been present throughout the proceedings. The outcome of the trial will determine the actor's legal fate and could have significant implications for his professional career. As the trial progresses, further details surrounding the alleged assault and the events leading up to Major's arrest will likely emerge. The jury will ultimately determine the verdict based on the evidence presented and the arguments made by both sides. It is important to note that this trial is ongoing and all individuals involved should be presumed innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. The proceedings will continue to unfold, offering a more comprehensive understanding of the case against Jonathan Majors and the evidence supporting it.